killed and shattered two families forever when he walked into his in-law's home in Wendell and murdered them both in cold blood. Now it's a Wake County jury's turn to decide if Holden should live or die. Our Steve Sprazier was there as prosecutors laid out their case for why he deserves the death penalty. Steve? The state is trying to prove that Nate Holden is a violent individual by bringing in testimonies from deputies who say that he engaged in a shootout with them after they tracked him following the murders. And when you hear these two gunshots ring out, what, you know, what, what's your reaction, sir? We've been ambushed. Wake County deputies said they had gone to a home where Nate Holden used to live searching for him. The SWAT team said they gathered in this armored vehicle to protect themselves. It was outside the house where they thought Holden was hiding. They then used this robot to search the home and discovered it was empty. A police canine then tracked Holden to a nearby field where he had a shootout with deputies. You put the flashlight on him, uh, and what's the next thing that happens? <clears throat> he immediately raises his right hand and starts shooting at me. Um, and did you um, actually see the muzzle flash? I did. Deputies say they returned fire at Holden while scrambling for cover and later found him on the ground. Uh, the subject was laying there unconscious uh, with the weapon slightly off his right hand on the ground. Late this afternoon, the defense began its case with a social worker who had worked with Nate back in 1995 when Nate was part of an after-school program. He said Nate's murder conviction shocked him. It was not the Nate that we knew. Um, again, Nate that we knew was quiet, was one of the leaders. The Nate that we knew would have prevented anything from happening. Now, the defense is going to continue its case tomorrow, and Nate Holden has already told the judge that he will not be testifying in his own defense during that case. Reporting live, I'm Steve Sprasher, CBS, North Carolina.